Hi there, Colin Storm here with Keller Williams Realty at Falls Church, and welcome to another Monday. Today I wanted to go back to something I mentioned last Monday in the One Minute Monday, and that is this uh, website called Expand Furniture. I've just been spending more time on there, and just thought it would be a lot of fun for some of you out there who might be interested in browsing around the site, getting ideas for um, some spaces you might have that you're not quite sure what to do with or you'd like to use uh, in a more efficient manner. Uh, and you know, not to mention people out there who might have a studio space to, to fill up. It's just all this furniture, some of it they've created, some of it they just curate from around the world and bring in and, and make available. Um, it just has multiple uses. You know, we think, when we think studios, we automatically think Murphy beds and things like that, which they do have, but just there's unique ways that they've combined some of these things. So if you have a look at, um, for instance, again, some of the Murphy beds, you not only have the bed that folds out, you think of a Murphy bed, you think of a box that's just up against the wall and folds out. But they have sofas that convert into beds. They have shelving that converts into a bed. Uh, they have beds that lift up and allow you to store things underneath, uh, so on and so forth. Um, and then, you know, if you, again, if you're thinking about your own living space, maybe you have smaller bedrooms that you like kids to share, but it's just so small you're not quite sure how you do it. Um, you can get several different bunk beds options, bunk bed options. You know, some of them, you know, they, there was couch that transitions into a bunk bed, bunk beds that just go up against the wall but fold out, um, bunk beds that mount to the wall and fold down, all sorts of different things, whether it's, again, you have kids that you'd like to have share a bedroom, uh, or maybe you want to have a room that serves a different purpose, maybe as an office, but then could be converted uh, to a guest bedroom. There's several different things for that. Uh, and, I'll, you know, so it's worth spending some time looking around. You might be inspired. These aren't the cheapest of items. Um, but again, a lot of times you have to look at the fact that you're paying for not just one piece of furniture, but sometimes two or three all in one. Uh, and, but to close out, I want to show you one of my favorite ones, uh, which is included in the post. And that's this little small table here. And I just envision this, you know, if you have a tiny studio, but want to have, but you work from home sometimes, you know, this is fantastic. Or for kids who are maybe, you know, middle school, high school age, they have more homework to do. There's not a ton of room in their bedroom for a desk. But they can have this in there, and it folds out, and uh, it gives them some some workspace uh, to work with. And uh, I just love if we just go to this little video real fast. The um, this is the, the chair Lindigo just Micro comes out of nowhere. Watch. <laughs> with two built-in drawers and a filing cabinet, there is plenty of space for it's, organization. Yeah, I just think that's just amazing. It even has a fully hidden chair. Open up the desk and take up. So you can see that you could have that in a room and not take up a lot of space, but it gives a lot of functionality you know, for someone to come home and do their homework. Or, again, if you're in a small space and trying to work from home every now and then but don't want your office space to take up so much room. Anyway, just something to look at. Have a look around. Again, this is the, the One Minute Monday for this week. I'm Colin Storm with Keller Williams Realty at Falls Church. and hope you enjoy this post.